Get your chance, do your dance at the Space Jam. All right. All right. We're showing you the coolest, newest, hottest new toys today. We have so many things from Jazzwares. We were um, jamming out to some Space Jam because we're going to be showing you some like jamming good stuff. And we got some, some basketball, which is also the secret word. We'll tell you about that in a second. The secret word? Basketball. basketball. <laughs> okay, we're starting over here. Don't look at this right now. We're starting over here at Minecraft. Um, Jazzwares makes uh, paper crafting sets and they also have these really cool posable figure sets that you can collect so that when you're not playing Minecraft and who isn't not yeah. Um, you can but you know play out your own action adventures um, right here on your tabletop, in your bedroom, in your playroom, wherever. Or you can also just collect them too. They're really yeah, nice. Yeah, they've got a really nice <clears throat> pixelated look to them and mm -hmm. like kind of that modular design that you see in the game and it kind yeah. of comes into life. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. We have two sets here, the <clears throat> excuse me, Minecraft Overworld Enderman set, which is about $8, mm -hmm. and the Survival Pack, which is about $15, and both are for ages 6 and up, and they are posable, see? Yeah, and you oh, can actually put this little pick in yes. Steve's hand. Yes! Yeah. And in this cool treasure chest, too, if you want. Oh, nice. And I like that he comes with a little bed. Super yeah. cute. <laughs> it's really cute. Yeah. I think it's really collectible, and fans of Minecraft will be all over these Totally, figures. Yeah. totally. <clears throat> okay, so we're gonna move on. Let me get these out of the way so that we can, because we have a full table today. We're gonna move on to the turtles. If you're yes. a fan of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, kind of like their um, paper craft for Minecraft, we also have them for Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. This set we actually didn't build. You can uh, build another turtle mm -hmm. and Shredder, actually, with some weapons and some cool accessories. We just built the Shell Razor, and uh, who's the purple one? Donatello? Yes! 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 I was gonna say Leonardo, so go Lori. Leonardo is red is Raphael, orange yep is Michelangelo, so, so blue is go. Leonardo. You're good. Yes, yes, yes. yes. You almost got it. <laughs> After years. <laughs> After years, I know. Um, this is free, just six and up, and it's nine ninety nine. And they do have other um, packs that you can build. Uh, just out of, it's basically just folding paper, following the instructions yeah. to fold paper in. And create your scene again. Nice to kind of play out, but also to, to have build a display. and create yeah. Your stuff as well. Yeah, too. yeah, very awesome. Okay, yeah. so I'm gonna get this out of the way, and we're gonna move on to. I guess we'll do this. Yeah. NBA Heroes. That's why we were listening to Space Jam, as we said. Space Jam. <clears throat> this is a, a whole line that imagines some of your favorite NBA players as superheroes. Mm -hmm. So right now we have who's this? Hello, Anthony. Good job, Jen. Who's this? LeBron James! Yay! Yes! We Sports! Taught, we taught it as well, Sports right? Before we All right. <laughs> the action figures are sold separately, and they also have um, several other players and more players to come. And they each come with, you know, the, their jersey, but then some special features. LeBron mm -hmm. has some silver skin, and then they have these cool um, special arms that you can attach. What? And they also shoot the basketballs. Woo! So you well, can shoot them at the bad guys. I think I'd like to watch a basketball game like that. <laughs> I think, I think that more, would be way more yeah, exciting. Yeah. yeah. Well, Jen, you can, you can play out your own basketball I game can. that way with yes, the ultimate true. game court, which is actually two sided. This has another side, so you can have like an arena court or a street court, mm -hmm. and they've got a lot of other surprises. The locker room becomes like a control center. Oopsies. And when you have it as a street court, you have um, a fire hydrant that also shoots a projectile, which is pretty cool. Nice. I really, Jen did this, by the way. I really like her yeah. handiwork for the design here. Yeah, well, that's because the Bell. figures are really, they're really posable. So they are posable. They yeah. They work really well. They're really detailed, too. They so. really are. Very yeah. nice. So this is great for um, NBA basketball fans ages six and up. Yeah. <gasps> okay. Oops, sorry, Mello. Oh, sorry. I'm oh, sorry. Lord, he's okay. He's okay. All right, I want to show you this because we want to have a lot of room to play with this mm -hmm. game. So we're going to start with this guy first. Let me make sure that he is turned Super on. Super cute. I know. Really chunky. <laughs> this is for. It responds the, to your voice, doesn't it? Does, it does. Oh, it does respond to your voice. I <laughs> forgot about that. It does. So, everybody be really quiet while we talk about this. This is Chuck the Talking yeah, Truck. Turned on. There he goes. Chuck the Talking Truck. It's very just tune up. It's a preschool toy. So, as you yeah. said, it's nice and chunky, easy for small hands. And you can give him a push. I So cute. Ah, so cute. And there's a, a function, right? The switch is on the bottom. Mm -hmm. Or, yeah, down here. If you want him to be voice activated, yeah. you can do that as well. And he will respond. But he also responds to, like, the TV or the radio. So, so yeah. Not, yeah. <laughs> yeah. But this is just super cute. Um, a really fun character that preschoolers love, especially if they're into construction, construction vehicles. Yeah, exactly. And this moves to... Um, I know a couple little 
little boys that would be all over this. Yeah, I know. Yeah. It's twenty nine ninety nine. Super cute. Yeah. Let's find some sand. I think I'd rather play bungees, but thanks, Chuck. Let's okay. do this. Okay, I really like this. Yeah. This is Flick to Stick Bungees um, Battlegrounds. They have a lot of sets. These little guys are actually collectible, so you can purchase more and play with even more than the four that come with this set. But they're magnetic, mm -hmm. and they stick to these hexagons in the center of the game board, and you're trying to flick them to land on, of course, you want the higher scoring hexagons, so you score more points. Mm -hmm. So you're gonna be the silver guy. Okay. There you go. You can go first. We take turns. You don't do it together. How are your flicking abilities? Well, Sorry. from I think I'm at a disadvantage from this angle because I'm right-handed, but well, that's okay. we'll see because I'm <laughs> I'm not that coordinated. So this stay is, with me, folks. This is for just six and up. There might be oh, good oh, job. Yeah. There might be a bit of a learning curve. Uh, uh. Oh, that counted. Okay. Now, if she, I have control of these flippers over here, so I can also try Ooh. to. Well, if you'd had a good one, I could Let's have tried to do that. Let's pretend that didn't happen. Oh. Uh, all right, so I get 25, you get 50, remove nice. them. Nice. And then we start from round two to Let's flick. Do and it. then from round three, and you're going until all of these are out. I really want to try to, to flip you. Yeah. Come over here. Oh! Got a little too aggressive. That was there. good flicking, Jen. <laughs> the ultimate goal is also to get the 100 in the center, mm. if you can see that. That's. That's the highest point on this. This is just really fun. Some skill in yeah. action. Lots of collectability too. So I you like can kind of guys. figure out Thank which you. guys flick the best, which guys stick the best. And then, you know, you have your defense action as well, which yeah. is really cool. I like this game. Yeah. I think there's like a little bit of a storyline behind the characters too. Or Alien, I think. Yes, yes. Yeah. You know what? We have reviews of all of these on TTPM. Lots mm -hmm. of other um, Bungie's products too. So you can find out even more on TTPM.com. Let's give stuff away. Yes. Let's do it. Woo! Oh, they kind of crossed over. We're gonna get a new thrower. <laughs> this is Kobe Bryant, NBA Heroes. And this is Blake Griffin. And you know that I actually have a story real quick. Um, I went to see him when we played in college once, and I had like courtside seats because I got upgraded, and he went for a ball that was going out of bounds, and he like landed in my lap, and I took pictures of him instead of helping him. All right. That sounds like a great idea. Kevin Durant! <laughs> oh, yeah, some bungees! We need a new catcher. <laughs> All right, here's you know what? One. I've been doing pretty good. All right, here's I another. Prepared. Here's another bungee set for you, the deluxe pack. All right. Okay. I'm ready. This is a big one. I'm ready. We didn't show you anything, but they Jazzers also makes really cool Yabba Gabba Yo, toys. Yabba Gabba. What? And oh, little under the bush. Oh, he's so cute. Yes. All right. So to try to enter for your chance to win, go to ttpm.com, click on the play date. You'll find all the rules to enter. It's always free to enter, and you have until midnight Eastern time on Wednesday, December third, to enter the secret word of basketball. <laughs> I don't enter it in the YouTube comments. It doesn't count. TTBM.com. Um, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel, though, yeah. so you can see all cool toy reviews every day. And we've got reviews of all these products on TTPM. So check it out, and we'll see you next week for more fun on the Playdate! Jam and I've